Director Spike Lee savaging the President of the United States while overseas at a film festival. That was given a chance to say we are about love and not hate. And that did not denounce the Klan, the alt right. And those Nazi, the so-called Creole democracy, that's some United States of America was built upon the genocide of Native people and slavery. That is the fabric of the United States of America. As my book and brother Jay-Z would say, facts. Joining me now with reaction, Diamond and Silk, ladies, is Spike doing the right thing there? Well, listen, little Spike Lee is just upset because he can't get the majority of his movies to spike to the top. So what he's trying to do is politicize this movie. That's right. Throwing daggers at a sitting president and calling a sitting president nasty names mm -hmm. is not going to get people to the polls. Now, we're not going to go watch no movie about no KKK. What he should have did was made a movie about how the Democratic Party, the party that he loved, created the KKK to intimidate, manipulate, and in order to dominate. That's right. What he need to do, little Spike need to do us all a little favor and zip it. That's right. And we look at little Spike Lee as one of the gatekeepers of the Democrat plantation. That's right. That's all he is. He don't want to see black people come up. All he want to see is black people stay stuck. That's why they make these boring movies to try to keep black people stuck in the pain of their ancestors and stuck in the pain of slavery. Well, all right. It looks like Diamond and Silk will not be seeing the new Spike Lee movie. No. So... You heard at the top, it's been a year since this Mueller investigation has gotten underway. We now know there's a mole, there was a mole, in the Trump campaign. I think we have some footage here. Let's see that. We now have that mole. Yes. Oh, and here he is. So you're the... Most, 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 most excellent agent we've ever seen. Yes, most excellent agent we've ever seen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so Obama had a mole in the Trump campaign, Diamond and Silk. What do you think about that? Well, you know, I think it's sick and I think it's sad. It's time for Mueller to end this investigation. This was a lie perpetrated by the left and manufactured by the left. Uh -huh. Mueller, what he should have been investigating is the DNC, Hillary Clinton and her campaign, her campaign manager brother, who allegedly uh, took, what, $170,000 from the Russians mm -hmm. in order to end the Russian sanctions up under the Obama administration. That's right. That's what should have been investigated. And guess what? I believe that President Trump, then Donald Trump, he was surveilled, he was wiretapped, yeah. and it was a mole. That's and right. if you don't believe me, why did Obama and the Obama administration allegedly have journalists wiretapped and surveilled? Why? So I believe the same thing happened to the Trump administration. Right. And guess what? Some people need to be called to the table. Yes. Some people need to go down for it. And be uh, locked up. That's right. All right. I think you were referencing James Rosen, Fox News reporter who was spot on by That's Eric right. Holder's Justice Department. Ladies, thank you very much, and hopefully the chit-chat tour is a smash hit.